Tonight's shocking video out of Monroe County. A boy in a wheelchair gets into a fist fight with a fellow student. That boy dealing with a serious bone disease. He is now in the hospital with a broken leg. Tonight the school says it has taken, quote, appropriate action. But the boy's mother says it's not enough. Here's Fox 2's Hannah Saunders. Students at Airport High in Carleton stood by and pulled out their phones as two students started to fight Monday morning, ending with a wheelchair-bound ninth grader on the ground and seriously injured. Lavette White is the boy's mother. I felt awful. He's in a public school, going to get an education. He's in a wheelchair. He has so many obstacles and hurdles in his life. She was outraged when she got the call saying her son Jordan was suspended and his leg broken. Jordan suffers from a brittle bone condition, leaving him vulnerable to injury and unable to walk. Jordan had to be rushed to Children's Hospital of Michigan, where he underwent emergency surgery on his leg Tuesday afternoon. He broke my son's femur in half, and it has a pin in it. So the pen is the mangle. She says the fight started with cyberbullying and that Jordan was being targeted with racial slurs and mean comments about his condition. My son said he felt scared and threatened, so he swung. And when he swung, he swung, and he swung again, and the whole wheelchair went over. She says the principal suspended her son and the other student for five days. We reached out to the school for comment and were told in a statement, the situation was handled appropriately by the high school administration and school liaison officer in accordance with the airport high school student handbook. Specific information regarding student discipline is confidential. Levette says Jordan is now out of surgery and recovering. As for the video, she says she has a special message for the one girl in the background who took a stand and helped Jordan after the fight. You are a very amazing young lady to stand up in a room amongst all these teenagers who just sat there and watched it and the ones that thought it was funny. She has a heart. In Detroit, Hannah Saunders, Fox 2 News.